otherwise you can't hear the awesome guests I have on stage. On stage. On stage. We have Hutch cosplaying as our stabber. Zach Wofford or the angry guy in the kilt that was not able to make it this year. not able to make it this year. Okay, bye Zach! Let's give a big round of applause for all of our participants tonight. Sorry, I had to give a growth fist. Oh, you gave the screen a growth fist? Yes. Awesome. And now, Nicole Scott would like to give a special presentation. Let's give her a round of applause! Probably help if I give you the mic. <laughs> Hi, my name is Nicole Scott, and this is my eighth year of Subasakan. regular attendant just like everyone sitting here in these seats today to do what I feel is right and give back to Subasakan in a way that I feel is most honest. It sounds cliche but having been at this con since I was 11, now I'm 19, I couldn't help but be a little nostalgic and thankful. There's a little project called Who I Am Makes a Difference, also known as the Blue Ribbon Effect Project. I'm not affiliated with them, I just was captivated by the idea. I know there are a million projects out there that involve blue ribbons, but instead of focusing on curing an illness, this is a project in which you give blue ribbons to people who have most impacted your life, usually attached with a letter explaining why. It started in New York when a teacher gave blue ribbons to every student in a graduating class because she felt they had impacted her in a big way. She gave each student ribbons to give to other people who had impacted them. After this, the trend spread, and anyone, even everyone here, can start by giving blue ribbons to people who you believe deserve it, or you can purchase official ribbons from their site to support their causes. This concept made me realize that I have a lot of people to thank. I would also really encourage each of you, if you desire to go to a local craft store and pick up some blue ribbon and distribute them yourselves. Now, I'm not the only person here today who is thankful to be surrounded by so many wonderful, caring, friendly people of similar interests, a family of sorts. There's an amazing positive energy that thrives every year at this con that I know all of us love. I know for a fact that I am not the only person here who is thankful for Subasa Khan, which is why I'm here today to give one of my blue ribbons to Subasa Khan. one person, but I felt the need to cheat a little bit. I would like to take a moment to thank volunteers, participants, attendees, programming, new guests, past guests, creators, staff, directors, believers, those with imagination and determination and drive, and everyone else who has made what we've experienced at Subasacon possible. Without all of these people, I would not have been here eight years ago, poorly dressed as Edward Elric. <laughs> Without them, I would not have believed that there was a community this large outside of my immediate circle of friends who did not bully me for my interests. Without the creators of Subasakan, I would not have developed some of the best memories of my life. And not only have I changed, I've seen some of my closest friends be affected magnificently by this local convention. but I have become an overall stronger person because of this convention 
It aided in a realization when I was 11 that I am free to express myself. When you're that age, you're told to be yourself, but nobody ever answers the question, what does that even mean? I learned I may be judged, but that won't stop me from being me. For many years now, I've been able to discuss in depth anime, manga, video games, Japanese culture, science fiction, fantasy, and things that would be considered nerdy or geeky. I've been able to discuss these things intelligently and confidently, even to those who believe it's stupid or a waste of time. I've learned to embrace it as a part of me rather than hiding it so it's easier to be accepted by peers. Because of this con, I've had the chance to see some of my closest friends from states away who I rarely see. I have also made quite a few long-lasting friends, some I would consider family, and I've met tons of people with interesting stories to share. It was at this con three years ago I realized I really liked this one guy, <laughs> and he ended up being my first and current boyfriend whom I love very much. by the way. <laughs> it's because of this con I've seen musical talent and artistic talent that I've marveled by. I've also seen amazing craftsmanship and cosplay and dedication that the numerous compliments given by all attendees does not even suffice to explain how amazing it is. This con has given me some of the best surprises of my life. I even seen friends fix heart-wrenching arguments in this convention center. I've seen so many hugs from strangers and acts of kindness that I never would have seen elsewhere, and I've felt so much love from being here. And that is only some of the things. Who knows, without this place to gather, speak out, and share ideas, who knows if any of these wonderful things I would have witnessed or experienced would have ever happened to me, or even those other people. I've seen this con grow by nearly a thousand people, and I have grown with it. It's been amazing to see this transformation, and then I think about my friends and myself, who have also experienced noticeable and astonishing growth. Now, before I conclude, I would like to ask everyone to do me a favor. Like I said earlier, I know I'm not the only person here who is thankful for SubasaCon. Now, you may be new here, you may be a veteran, but so the staff can get an even clearer picture, I would appreciate it if you would please stand if Subasacon has even had the tiniest impact on your life. <laughs> so to Subasacon, I present a blue ribbon to you for impacting my life in a profound way. Subasacon, we all thank you. Happy 10th birthday, and everyone have a nice rest of the convention. Uh, I think I speak on behalf of the entire staff. I mean, we've always said we do it for you guys, so this, this means a lot. You're awesome!